Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I thought that I would film me showing you what I eat in a day. I haven't filmed one of these in ages and I wanna film more of them. Um, but yeah, I thought I'd show you what I eat today. I am at work, so this is gonna be a what I eat in a day when I'm at work version. Um, I tend to get up in the morning and have my iced coffee. That's like the first thing that I have in the morning. I just feel like it gives me energy and I don't know, I just, I don't feel hungry in the morning, so that is actually the first thing that I have in the morning. Then I will do my makeup, get dressed, come downstairs, and then I'll make my breakfast. We didn't have any bread in, so I couldn't have toast, and sometimes I'll do overnight oats or something, but today I literally just had a banana and some, like, what, a Nutella substitute, so like, basically Nutella, but it's not Nutella, the brand. Um, and yeah, I haven't had that in ages, like, over a year, but today I had it. Um, so that was what I had for breakfast, just plain and simple. I'm never usually that hungry when I'm at work um, in the morning because it's quite early in the morning. I get up at half past six, so I'm not usually that hungry. Then what I do is in the morning at work, I usually have a mocha from the machine. It's an express chalk. So I might try and take a picture of that and insert a picture of what that looks like on the screen, but that's what I usually have. And I also have a little um, chocolate bar or a biscuit or something like that, like a digestive biscuit type thing with that. Then when it gets to lunchtime at work, I will have a wrap. Today I made a wrap and I had a wrap and in it was cheese and I also had in some orange pepper and I added in a little bit of ketchup as well and then um, wrapped it up and that's what I had for my lunch alongside some crisps. So I also had, I think they're like Lidl or Aldi's version of Quavers. Um, so I had those, very low calorie. So if you're looking for low calorie snacks, that's a good one. Um, then in the afternoon, for my afternoon break at work, I had another express chalk. And with that, I had um, either a biscuit or a chocolate bar. I haven't actually had my day yet. This is the morning before I've gone to work, um, but you'll see in images on the screen. Um, also with my lunch, I also had a Vimto. A Vimto, I always have a Vimto with my lunch um, from the machine, because it's a free vending machine. So yeah, um, I'm, I'm very like, I have my routines of what I do. And then when I get home from work, I tend to potentially maybe have an apple or something like that. Don't know if I'll do that today, um, probably not. Um, and then this evening I'm planning on having my um, low dough pizza base and I'm gonna try and make a pizza um, out of that because it's a low calorie pizza base, but I will show you that when I get home and I will vlog that then. The reason why I'm just sat here chatting my way through my breakfast and lunch is because I pre-made my lunch yesterday in advance because it gives me more time in the morning, so yeah. See you when I get back. Right, I'm back from work. My face is looking red because I had to wear a dust mask all day. But basically when I got back in, I had a pear and also an elderflower um, cordial drink with sparkling water. I'm now about to make my like tea, not a cup of tea, my food. And I'm gonna use, oh, maybe it is two then. Oh, I That's thought it was what only I saw one. Yesterday. Oh right, yeah. it's two. Yeah, I'm gonna use one of these um, pizza bases, basically, basically, um, and basically. I keep saying basically, <laughs> and oh, I want to say basically again. Okay, basically they're 39 oh, calories. I couldn't it. think any other words. <laughs> <laughs> they're 39 calories it says they're high fiber fat-free low carb gluten-free dairy-free high protein keto sugar-free and vegetarian so basically it's made of air but i am gonna give it a go you can make it into pizzas you can make it into a quiche make it into fajitas wraps or cakes I made that into a cake. Um, I think you just roll it up, I don't know. But I'm gonna make it into a pizza anyway, so let's see how this goes, because I've not had these before. Right, mum's having difficulties with some Netflix password. Logging in and passwords, I'm not alone, I know. Oh. Um, I popped it on this like little baking grease brew sheet. It feels quite thin, which I was expecting, and quite airy, so we'll have to see. Um, but basically, you pop on your toppings, 
and then you pop it in the oven for about seven minutes. So it won't take me long to make my tea tonight. Um, two comes in each pack. You can get them off Amazon. That's where I bought mine, just kind of FYI. Um, so let's give it a go. Right, I've added the passata on top. It's um, tomatoes, chopped tomatoes with herbs. I just finished off the tin because otherwise I'd just get wasted. I've added olives and peppers to my pizza. Right, I have now added the cheese and I am gonna pop this in the oven. Low calorie pizza, because the dough's only 39 calories and the topping won't be that much. It'll be just be the cheese that like adds up the calories. So it's gonna be quite a decent meal. Well, you hope so. Yeah, I'll let you know. Off we go on our journeys. All gets priced in the way. Me, just it's got it half. <sighs> we got that on video. That's my fault, so I was looking about. <laughs> Look what she just did. Oh man. Uh, are you mad? Sorry, Tom, that's yours. <laughs> it's Tommy's. That's Tommy's pizza board. I was getting you one. Ugh. That's why you don't mess around, kids. <laughs> oh, God you get to watch that on, on Wednesday. That was loud. Yeah, I saw it falling and I went like this before it even fell. To be honest, I knew it was going, but I didn't think it was going to go in half. Oh. Oh. Does that mean what you? I think that's probably me. Probably telling you to stop messing around. Yeah, stop breaking pizza boards. I showed Dad and I put it on video so I can literally show him. Eey. Oh dear. I did that with one of my travel boards, lol. Uh, We're in the oven. Are we? R.I.P. Oh no, my pizza's in the oven. Mm. How do you feel about what just happened? Well, a little bit silly. <laughs> 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 I'm not gonna lie. A little bit silly. That, that's how things get broken when you're messing about, so. Mm. Lesson learned. <laughs> my hello my pizza is now out the oven this is what it's looking like i'll let you know when i've eaten it what i think to it right and then for pudding i'm gonna have half of this brownie that mum bought me um the other day so i'll just literally cut it in half and then i'll have half tonight and then half tomorrow don't want to be poorly so yeah is it a lotus biscoff one yeah it looks like it's got other things on it it looks nice Fantastic. The brownie in its natural habitat. <laughs> Hello, Mum. Hello. <laughs> We're watching Gino and Fred and Gordon. Gordon, Gino, and Fred. Yeah. I've got my cup of tea and. I may have had the other half of my brownie. Right, the program is now finished. So I thought I would end this video. This is what I eat in a day video. Good night. Goodbye. Remember to subscribe. See you in my next video, which is going to be podcast episode three. Hopefully. Bye-bye now.